the 2021 Porsche Taycan 4 Cross Turismo. It's a stunning car during the daytime, we all have to agree. But I think when it gets a little bit dark and the lights turn on, it looks way, way better than it does during the daytime. starts with the matrix LEDs at the front and I really really like the design so during the daytime you have your DRLs they look good too you have the four dots as it is now with uh, a few of the Porsche models but you know these have its own distinct style and I think they look amazing so that's the front of the vehicle with these beautiful beautiful matrix LED lights that work really really well in providing enough light for the journey home at night then like i've already mentioned we swing to the back and we see how awesome this red led strip looks and it just kind of goes all around the back of the vehicle and for me whenever i see something like that i know exactly that this is a porsche taycan driving right in front of me it's a very distinctive style and it fits the vehicle perfectly, I think. It looks pretty good. And it's, I think, one of the standout features. You know, a lot of people have said that they don't really like the way the back looks, but for me, I think it looks even better from the back, but only the Cross Turismo, because the normal Taycan, I think, still looks better from the front, but the Cross Turismo really looks good from the back. So now let's step inside and see what the interior looks like. So as you guys can see, we have a lot of nice ambient lights. So you've got your cup holders illuminated very nicely. You have a little cubby storage here underneath the middle center of the car. And then over there, armrests, pockets are illuminated. Okay. Looks really, really nice. And you know, when you sit inside a car like this, it truly makes a statement. All right, so we are in the ambient light settings. So as you guys can see, there is a bunch of colors here. So um, let's start from the top. So here first we have cold white. So this is what cold white looks like. Then the next one down, oops, sorry, warm white. Okay, so if you prefer a little bit of a warmer ambiance then the next one what do we have we have dark orange so this is what dark orange looks like all right next one we have poppy red so this is what poppy red looks like and obviously this is throughout the whole car right so um front and back i'll go i'll show you guys in the back so this is topaz blue very very nice color um and then the, my favorite the one that i had set up um as atlantis so that is Atlantis. It doesn't really show the real true color that you guys see on the screen, but it's really hard to get the real true color, but it's close enough. Then obviously we have a lime green um, because this is a green vehicle. Um, so it's only fitting that we have a lime green color. And then the last one is dynamic. So it says here, dynamic ambient light selected. The color will be adjusted to the music cover. There is also footwell um, ambient lighting, which is the same color um, as the door and everything else. So that adds an extra touch. I think that's that's really cool. And the same thing here in the back. So we've got ambient lighting here in the footwell, here where we have the grab handles on the other side as well. And the door pockets are all lit up really, really nicely. And then of course here we have our LED lights, reading lights. So in case you want to read, you can turn them on. You've got on both sides, so there you go. They're quite bright, I have to say. There are no lights in the middle because this is all a panel um, glass roof, which is really, really beautiful. Yeah, so we've got those two lights, reading lights, if somebody needs to read in the back. But. Yeah, and that's the view towards the front of the cabin. And then moving
jumping to the back of the car, we're going to open up the, the trunk. It goes up really nicely. So here in the trunk, I have a few things, my camera stuff. So we have lights here and lights here to illuminate this space. Let's not forget about the front trunk area and let's see if it is illuminated. Yes, it is. There is a single LED light illuminating this space here. So if you have any things there that you need quick access to, even at night, you will be able to find exactly what you are looking for.